Hi, my name is Justin Winterhalter. I'm a region sales manager here with the Winger Corporation. Today we're going to talk about Winger's Soundlock Sound Isolation Rooms. So Winger's been making sound isolation rooms for 50 years for music practice. And during that time, they've continuously improved the product and we're now in our ninth generation of Soundlock rooms. So there's two major benefits when it comes to modular practice rooms versus built-in practice rooms. The first is the fact that they are relocatable and reconfigurable. And what we mean by that is you could take this room, disassemble it, and move it to a completely different location when you're ready to do so. Or if you want to reconfigure the sizes, let's say you want a larger wall or a smaller wall or move the door to a different location, you can do that as well because they're reconfigurable. And one of the secrets to these rooms are the fact that all the components themselves are what create the sound isolation. So there's no additional assembly of caulk, there's no additional gasketing or anything like that required when you move it to your new location. What you see is what you get. The second major benefit of modular rooms over built-in rooms is the fact that the performance is guaranteed. Because even flawless design can fail if the execution isn't perfect or if it's modified after the fact. And when we talk about guaranteed performance, we use a measurement called NIC, or Noise Isolation Class. Now you may have heard of STC, which is Sound Transmission Class, but STC refers to an individual component like this door or this window. Noise Isolation Class refers to the entire assembly. So you can be assured that the entire assembly of the modular room is guaranteed to meet that performance. And the performance metrics that we meet are inside the room to outside the room. It's an NIC of 41. So that would be from the interior of the room to a hallway. When you go from a room to another room, we have an NIC metric of 63. I've actually gone as high as NIC 67, but that's unofficial. Now the key to our sound isolation are these modular acoustic panels. These are made from steel skin, and inside the steel skin is the secret to our sound isolation. The outside walls are four inches thick, and the ceiling is six inches thick. And now that you've seen the outside, let's go inside. So here we are in the interior of the room, and the first thing that you're gonna notice is the design of the modular panels. We have two different types of panels. There's solid panels and perforated panels. And what that allows us to do is tune the room acoustically so there's not too much or too little absorption. And the other benefit to these modular panels is we can do all sorts of different sizes of rooms. So you can do a room as small as five and a half feet by six feet for an individual who's playing a small instrument, or we can do rooms all the way up to 20 to 25 feet for a pretty sizable ensemble. And I'll tell you a little secret. If you don't know the size of your room, give us a call. We can work with you to help determine what your application is and how much room you have, and we'll build a layout that works most efficiently in your space. So this room also has something really special, which is our VAE technology. And that means it has a built-in microphone and speakers. So you have built-in record and playback. But in addition, you can replicate different virtual acoustic environments. So this room doesn't have to just sound like a practice room. It can sound like a much larger venue, like a cathedral or a sports arena. You probably also noticed some of these additional panels. What those are are our comm ports. And those are acoustically baffled conduit runs that can be used for all sorts of additional equipment. Some of the common ones that we see are fire alarms or strobes. Uh, we'll see things like recording equipment or any sort of additional electronic components that you'd want to have in the room. This room also has its own ETL certified electrical system, which means it has an LED dimmable light fixture as part of the ceiling component. It has a two gang electrical outlet. And for those forgetful students who forget to turn the lights off, we can also outfit this with an occupancy sensor to save energy. We have modular options for the doors as well. The standard door is three feet wide, but for wider instruments, we can do a four foot door, or for the really wide ones, we can also do a six foot door that has a removable mullion. In terms of access, this standard lever set is the base, but we can also do a mortise lock or an RFID reader for electronic access too. You'll notice that this door has a window. All of our doors have windows as standard, but we also can do windowed panels as well. So this panel has a full length window but for applications where they need a wider viewing area, like, like a recording studio, we can also do windows that span multiple panels. 